Hi everybody and welcome back to my channel. This is my daughter Samantha Hi. from Mummy and Munchkin. Yeah, we're still working on the name, okay. but yeah, it's been changing. <laughs> so today we are going to do a review of these compression sacks that I've bought from Tripped and they are a dual sided compression bag. They are good for families with young children and solo travellers just like me. So this is what the bags look like. So it's got three zips. The first zip is here and it opens up this back section. With the packs come with little labels. So you've got his, hers, baby, kids, accessories, blah, 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 blah. Um, you can write on these ones. I think I'm going to use these ones more than this because obviously I don't have a his or a hers. So yeah. These ones for me are going to be better. Or, so if you've got more than just a kid and a baby, you can write each individual name of the child on it and then put it in. Oh, I think they've got a quick release as well. So there's the two tabs and on the front one, I think you can just... Ah. Pull it open cool. for quick release. So these go in here. There's a little hole there, and you can easily see it and grab it out. Simple. So on the other side, we have where is it? I've lost it. <laughs> I can't find it. There we go. Got him. Oh, yeah, the quick release thing. And then, no, hang on. The other side is this side. There. And I'm going to use this for my dirty washing, I think. So what I'll do is I'll put my clean washing in this side and then once i've used the t-shirt and it's dirty i will just wherever the side is put it in here so it doesn't take up any more room and another brilliant thing is they are expandable so they're expandable didn't know that you put it you undo this middle zipper on the side all the way around 365 degrees and yes. it expands it by about an inch and a half Okay, goodbye. There's also, is that a little pocket or not a little pocket? I think there's a handle. <clears throat> We're getting in a muddle here. Oh, a handle to grab it by. So when it's all zipped up and it's all expanded, you can see there's a handle here, the quick open there, and it is about an inch and a half thick for your main clothing. And then on the other side, you see the thinner side which comes out a little bit, actually, if you look at it, it does have the little seams, so it does come out a bit um, for dirty or maybe shoes. If you've got kids, you can put their shoes on this side. Hadn't thought of that either, but clothes on I think your side. shoes might be a bit big for that. Well, Elliot's will fit. <laughs> so Elliot's will fit. And like this. And how much are they? These were... Actually, I don't know how much they are, so I will drop the price in about here. <laughs> yeah, but I'm really glad. I've been struggling a little bit doing my traveling because I thought that just the regular bags would be fine. But having traveled long term, when you get your dirty laundry, you don't want to be traveling somewhere and putting your dirty laundry in with your clean. So then there's always another bag involved. So I have to say, having the two sides on the compression sacks is much better. I think I'm really going to enjoy using these. Don't know yet whether I'll take one or two of them, but yeah. And they're soft as well. Wow. They're they easily foldable, moldable, very small, very tiny. Definitely. And so, so easy with kids, you can put all of each individual child's stuff in it and then just hand it to them <laughs> and, and they're done. Actually, sometimes when I stay in hostels or when I stay in hotel rooms, the drawers that you get aren't always the cleanest. Yeah. So this, you could just literally open it up, tuck that bit underneath and put that in the drawer like a drawer lining so you've still got the clothes in there yeah yeah cool so if you are going traveling with a family or on your own i would highly recommend the tripped um travel bags the tripped what are these called mm -hmm. um compression things 
Compression bags. Um, no, they've got a name. They're called travel sacks. No, they are packing called cubes. packing cubes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Right. Start again. Cut. Right. <laughs> if you're going traveling as a family or on your own, I highly recommend these packing cubes from Trit. They're not expensive for what they are. And yeah, I think they will do well for absolutely both family and solo travellers. So thank you for watching Nan with a Backpack, along with Samantha, Mummy my daughter, Mummy and Munchkin. And I will see you again soon. Yeah. Bye. Bye.